What's up everyone? It's Will Lett with Urbex and Coasters and I am here at the Santa Cruz Beach Boardwalk tonight and if you can tell by the expression on my face, my day got a lot better by coming here. But the reason I decided to come here was to get night rides on Giant Dipper and it certainly delivered. It's absolutely as good as the my previous two visits to the boardwalk and like how is that ride that good? Like, you know, we're talking about a ride that's a hundred years old. How is it so good? Like, I, like I'm just, every time I'm, I, I'm just left saying that. How is that ride so good? But yeah, so how is it at night compared to during the daytime? I mean, it's, it's cool. It's a night ride. <laughs> like, that's that's what I say. It's just, it's one of those rides where the ride experience itself. I'm saying, how is that ride so good? But like at night with the lights on, it's not all that different from a day ride. But it is still warmed up. It's juiced. The trains are flying. So it's definitely a different experience than during the daytime. But it's not like you're having to. It's not like you're not able to see where the track goes or or anything like I mean I know the layout pretty well with how many times I've ridden it at this point but I mean it's it's an awesome ride and I'm just going to say if you have not had your opportunity to get a night ride here on Giant Dipper it is very important to do so as a coaster enthusiast and it's a harder night ride to get because oftentimes during the week this place will close at like five or six and then and then on on weekends like it was right at the very end that i was able to get a night ride because like i mean the place is the place closes at like nine so it's like when you're talking this close to the summer solstice it's hard to get a night ride on it. You have to be pretty lucky. And well, I managed to get a night ride on it. So I feel pretty lucky for that. Like, I mean, there is a part of me that wishes that I was going to be attending CoasterCon at CoasterCon this coming week, because it's like, then I could potentially, you know, be getting a night, a true night ride on Giant Dipper and we could, as attendees of the event, we there's the opportunity to customize your experience of, hey, do you want lights on or off a lot of the times with things like that. I know Knobles did that with Phoenix when, when it was ERT for ACE members on Phoenix. When I did CoasterCon at Knobles, a couple that featured Knobles a couple years ago so like I mean I know there's certain experiences that that you get from those conferences but like I mean I can't afford to take a whole week off work to go to my home parks uh, so yeah but I'm I'm really happy that I came out to Santa Cruz tonight got some night rides here on Giant Dipper and it holds up to everything that I have built it up to on my last several visits to Santa Cruz.